Yes people, it's the captain. Welcome back to another vlog. I am in the Yardley area of Birmingham today. I'm at a place called Brooklyn Fried Chicken. The name gives it away. It's American based team going on full of fried chicken. But specifically they also do a Philly cheesesteak. And that's what I'm here to try out today. I'm here to try out the Philly cheesesteak. Because I heard a lot of good things about it. It's situated on Stockfield Road. I will show you the location. I'll pan it around in a bit. So the owners have just had a nice warm welcome. I've had a chat to them. They're initially based in America, so that's why they've brought that American concept over here in Birmingham as well. So they got businesses over there. I've got my cousin with me as well. You've seen him in my previous uh, food review when I did a review down a pizza box. He's gonna be tagging along with me as well. Uh, we're going to order and then we're going to track on with the review then. Alright, come on, let's do this. So the location is on Stockfield Road. It comes under the Yardley area of Birmingham. So if you come from Warwick Road, yeah, straight on the Warwick Road, come onto Stockfield Road, come all the way and then the shop is right over here. That's the location of where the shop is. Put inside, you've only got a few seats available. Uh, two on this side and then one over there. You've got some outside as well. But uh, I'm not going to record that because there's somebody there. Got a massive menu from left to right. Here's your chicken, fried chicken options, wings. You got wraps, paninis, loaded box meal, burgers, and then over here you've got the Philly King of Philly cheesesteaks. So we're going to go for classic Philly tender pork beef, grilled onion stuff into a toasted sub with meal and cheese and then we're also going to go for the loaded grilled chicken sub as well that's got chicken tenders in there as well you get me and then quite a variety of different Philly cheesesteaks going on and then over here you've got the additional things as well they're called Brooklyn Tangs so like cheeseburgers, smash burgers, looks like it. Uh, so yeah, quite a massive menu going on. Alright, so people, the food's here. Yeah, it's smell like whatever here. We've got the loaded grilled chicken sub right over here. There you go, and then we've got some loaded fries as well. I've got my main man, yeah, shout out to my cousin Atik. Yeah, he's with me tagging along on this review as well. He recommended it to me as well. Uh, it was a place that I wanted to come down as well. So let's not delay and let's get stuck into this. So look at these juicy chicken Yourself. grilled Yourself. pieces. Yeah, melted. Sauces. Melted with the cheese. You got some onions. Yeah, you got some red peppers in there as well. Uh, I believe you got mushrooms as well. Toasted. Uh, almost like a subway, isn't it? Bismillah you know, yeah. walaikum. Uh, so let's talk in on Chirubara. Thank you. Now, shall I swear away? That sub, yeah, is really, really delicate and soft. I've got to say, from the top, as you can see, look, it is toasted. But even though, you know, sometimes when you have like burger buns or subway buns, they're toasted, they get dried out, don't they? From the bottom, it's really, really spongy and soft. So that really yeah. elevates the chicken um, and all the rest of the ingredients when you're having it you get me because when you take that first when you take the first bite of the burger or the, you know the bread or whatever you have that first bite has to be a noise it's juicy soft one otherwise it's going to put you off so that is a great start the chicken is also really juicy and delicate as well i'm going to get another bite going Yes, most definitely. It's got some crispy edges around the batter, but you can taste more of that juicy chicken within it. And the cheese and all the other ingredients complement it really well. I'm going to give this straight away a very good. That's my captain's view takers waiting for this. I'm going to hand it over to my cousin. He's behind the camera. You carry on and let me know about your verdict, right? That's got a lovely kick to it, hasn't it? Mm -hmm. And there's definitely 
authentic American sandwich. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, very different. Yeah, yeah, very different. Isn't it? Very different. Yeah. Well, you normally have like uh, as a typical burger. Yeah, or it's not your. Sandwich. It's not like a baguette, or it's not like yeah, a yeah, yeah. Uh, so somewhere in between on both. And the fried chicken in there, mm. loaded with the jalapenos or jalapenos. Yeah, yeah. With the cheese. With the mushrooms, you know, it's all going off, Captain. It is, isn't it? It is. It's all going off. That's it, man. That's great to hear. Move on to the loaded fries. You got some fried chicken pieces. I mean, you got the cheese. You got jalapenos. Let's get stuck into this stuff. What I do like about loaded fries when you have it is like it's all constructed together you get me mm -hmm. like with all the ingredients so you got the fries underneath then you got obviously the chicken pieces got the cheese melted on top mm -hmm. and you got the jalapenos so you got a lot of flavors popping through mm -hmm. that's the main thing and this one for me is a decent those chicken pieces again are nice and tender that is really with a crispy crispy fried edges around the outside uh, and that cheese complements it really well as well but for me this is a decent Okay, so because he's having the loaded fries now, he's going to give you his verdict. So what are you saying then? Okay, getting the cheese in there, getting the... Do you like the jalapenos in there? What is this? Some sort of chicken pieces in there. Yeah, yeah chicken. Um, fried chicken pieces. And some caramelized onions. I'll give you a little dip as well. Just move that. Mm. This is very good. Very yeah, yeah, nice. I, I gave it a decent to be honest. That's my obviously you know, um, my you know opinion. What, you know what I like in it? Yeah, it's, yeah. Got, it's got quite a few ingredients in there. It is definitely a loaded fries yeah, yeah. box or whatever you want to call it. Yeah. Um, you can see them. Normally in other places what you get is you get some fries with some cheese on top. Yeah. And that's about it. With this you got chicken fried chicken in there you got jalapenos in there you got caramelized onions in there the chicken ratio is um, uh, great though it's unbelievable yeah because um, normally other places yeah you get chicken uh, is yeah. it, 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 little little yeah, little, yeah. little tiny pieces so there's definitely a yeah, lot yeah. going on in there captain cool. and you know what i'm really impressed with this mashallah um this is very good for me all right cool let's move on to the philly cheese steak when that comes in cool. mm. so we're gonna move on to the loaded Philly cheesesteak. Yeah, this one I believe it cost me this one there, eight sixty nine. So in terms of pricing, again, this is my first one having it, so I'm not sure how it compares to other places. You know what I'm saying? So that looks like a mega house. That is mm. powerhouse look full <laughs> with that loaded wow. full beef, man. Melted cheese. You got jalapenos. Yeah. You and got some red, red peppers going on. You got some mushrooms. And the aroma coming off again, really, really amazing. Let's get, let's not delay them. Ooh, that beef is pulling away. <laughs> cheese! Cheese with a Philly cheese steak. <laughs> Alright, come on, let's just fill out. Cheese! <laughs> uh, where do I start from? This one. Uh, that bite just gave it all away. <laughs> Your facial expressions. Oh, no. I think this one's gonna go yo, off the scale. The juices coming off this are just yo. Look how tender that is, man. Look, like you know back, you know what back home and even in your, in your own yard, my cousins will agree with this. You know, you know when you have a bang on lamb and curry. No, I mean it's a it kinda goes up. It kinda goes up, yeah. Spray from the cow. You get me? That is an unbelievable just straight away. Yo. So, Captain, you that's what you that. normally have in your katwa, you know when the yeah, katwa yeah, that's gets it. stringy? That katwa dish, yeah, the pieces of beef are just proper juicy, tender, it this way? yeah, yeah, and that's a are just shot. pulling all the water around in my mouth. I can't wait to have my bite, mm. Captain. Lots of flavours going on as well, I recommend. So make sure you pop down and let me know what you think. Alright. Mmm. 
Well, what are you scoring it yeah, then, yeah. Captain? I've given it unbelievable, Jeff, already. Have you? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I missed that. You missed that out when you were asleep. <laughs> Jeez! <laughs> right, so, you, I'm going to hand it over to you. This is very, very constructive. Definitely. Uh, constructed. Captain. Was it falling apart? No, it's definitely saying? not yeah, falling apart. The beef pieces, um, yeah, were uh, staying within. And look the how sub. soft that is, man. Proper soft, that's, what, that's, what, that's what we said at the start, didn't we? Uh -huh. Proper yeah, soft. The it doesn't get dry quick time, innit? It's toasted yeah, nicely. Yeah. So let's go for this. Bismillah. Move the camera out of the way. Wow. Speechless. <laughs> man, I was loving it, you know. You know, the best thing about this beef is mm. it's not chewy. Yeah, yeah, you know, yeah. yeah. you get certain kind of bush. Yeah, yeah. Which is chewy. Chewy, innit? This isn't chewy, this is like dissolving. And dissolving right? straight away. You know, it's like burning. Muy past the talete you leave it. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> you get it? So, mashallah, yeah. This is, um, for me, it's definitely uh, um, a Holland. A Holland of, <laughs> of its, um, of its caliber. Uh, it's up there. So, yes, people, I was just munching away, enjoying my food and uh, just having a lovely conversation with my cousin and I just forgot to do my uh, outro <laughs> did my intro, did all my other things that I needed to do but I forgot my outro so try this place, I recommend it the Philly cheesesteak yeah it was nice and juicy tender all those lovely beautiful adjectives that um, you need that match up with a beautiful banging um, beef piece of meat and I just told my cousin park up and let me just complete it here so hit that subscribe button as well show some love and support with your support the channel is growing and i'll give my final thoughts to my cousin uh, i'll hand it over to him and then we'll finish off there then. okay captain that was a lovely um meal light <laughs> brooklyn's finest um, brooklyn fried chicken brooklyn fried chicken yeah yeah um authentic american uh philly sandwiches yeah yeah um i've never tasted anything like it um, definitely something different and um, a very good for me um, I hope the brothers you know keep doing what they're doing nice and um, that's out for me too. that's it man alright nice one cool then take care then peeps Thank you.